Hey, this is Brad with LookMold.com and today we are going to talk about white mold. Now everybody knows about black mold, but nobody really talks about white mold. So I'm going to show you what it is, if it's dangerous, and how to clean it. Now first, before we get started, go ahead and subscribe so you get updates when I release new videos in regards to mold. The first thing you need to know is there is no scientific term white mold. White is literally just referring to the color of the actual mold present. The three species of mold that will generally be white in color is Cladosporium, Penicillium, and Aspergillus. Now, these types of mold will usually start in the beginning stages of growing on building material after a leak, and then after a while, if the, the area is still getting wet, Stachybotrys, which is also known as black toxic mold, will start to overtake that Penicillium, Aspergillus, or Cladosporium and start growing over that area on the building material. It is also not uncommon to see white mold on personal contents such as clothes, shoes, furniture, and whatnot. The reason for that doesn't necessarily have to be due to water damage due to an actual leak. It could be due to your air conditioning unit not dehumidifying properly. Your air conditioning's purpose is to not only cool your, your home, but also dehumidify, which is, is actually pulling moisture out of the air. Now, once you have relative humidity that passes over 60%, mold can really start to grow. You have hot, humid air, especially if the AC is cooling properly, it's blowing cold air and humid air into the same environment. It causes condensation, which will start to lead to mold growth. Now, if you keep your, your closet closed, you may see it on your clothing because it gets more humid in there and you probably have a register if you have a walk-in closet and it's just blowing cold air into a small closed space. Now if you see this type of mold growing on your clothes, do not sound the alarm. I said don't sound the alarm because it's really not that big of a deal for the most part unless your clothes were water damaged. You can generally put your clothes through a normal cycle of the laundry machine. Um, you can put it through twice if necessary and you can also, some people add vinegar which actually does the trick as well. Now as far as your personal contents, you may need to go through a process called sanitization by our licensed remediation company. They will bring in these special kind of vacuums called HEPA vacuums and also damp wipe down the furniture to get the mold out of the actual furniture and make sure it doesn't come back. Prevention is always going to be your first choice when it comes to mold in your home. The two best ways to do that is to ensure your air conditioning unit is dehumidifying and drying up any leaks within 24 to 48 hours. If you have to call a water damage restoration company, then it needs to be done. Usually your, your insurance company will cover that. So prevention really is key. This has been a tutorial on white mold. If you have any other questions, please put it in the comment box and please like this video. Also, go to lookmold.com for more information on mold.